On April 20, 1979, then-U.S. President Jimmy Carter went fishing alone on a small boat in Plains, Georgia. When he got back, he told his staff he had been chased by a swamp rabbit swimming toward his boat and that he had splashed water at it with his paddle to shoo it away. But they didn't quite believe him, claiming that rabbits couldn't swim and if they could, they wouldn't approach a human threateningly. A few months later, he recounted the story to his press secretary, Jody Powell, who relayed it candidly to a reporter. The media decided to run wild with it starting in August 1979, with some referring to the animal as a killer rabbit in a nod to this scene from the immensely popular film Monty Python and the Holy Grail, released in 1975. That rabbit's got a vicious street a mile wide. It's a killer. What started as an amusing side story got twisted into a talking point by Carter's political detractors, who pointed to his response of splashing some water with a paddle as a sign of weak resolve, even bringing it up during the Iran hostage crisis later that year. To aid the credibility, the White House released this photograph of the incident, clearly showing Carter splashing water with a paddle toward a swimming rabbit. While Carter may not have been the most effectual president, he certainly wasn't much of a liar. 